Now that would be gross. <laughs> that would be. Um, yeah, we like sardines. Four. Yeah. So we have um, we have four big boxes tonight, and one baby one, and one package. We still have four more to go, and um, we're going to leave those for tomorrow night. I'm slowly but surely getting caught up. And uh, I've been I've had a very busy day, and I feel like I haven't accomplished too much other than get tired today. I'm kind of pooped out today, so you have to bear with me, um, please. Uh, I found out. Remember last night we got those really cool stamps, the Sarah stamps and the Putter stamps. Did you see those? Mm -hmm. Those they're awesome. Um, those are from Peggy S, the volunteer that's here on Thursday afternoon. So um, those those are from Peggy, and um, she had a lot of fun making or uh, sending off for those. I think yeah, that that was really cool. Look at this cat, isn't he? Uh, he's just so handsome. Patty, you could get yourself in big time trouble doing that, buddy. Okay, well we're gonna get to boxes, um, and uh, we'll just do a little one first. And Judy's Judy's volunteered to take anything back that away. Oh, so oh, this is from Jill R, our London friend, our London web camera. Is Jill R on? Isn't he handsome? One of these days we'll get back to normal, and I'll start doing questions again and things like that, and uh, we'll get we'll get caught up yet. It says, hi, Mama Jackie, I visited, <laughs> I visited the Paddington Bears at Paddington State Stratton. I'm sending you a souvenir. Love, Patty. <laughs> Check this out. See all the Paddingtons? And there's Patty right smack dab in the middle. Isn't what that is awesome? Paddington Bears. Oh, yeah. I've heard Paddington Bears. Yeah, the Paddington Bears and Patty. How did you get them? Wait, Jill R., how did you get them to let you do that? Yeah, the first time I've seen that Patty cat. Oh, time for a snack. This is a fridge magnet, and it's the Paddington um, Bear. Isn't that cool? That's the oh, patty. yeah, that's a trap. You know when? Yeah, I never. I'll put this on the refrigerator one. for now. But when our stuff comes back from the patty, um, we'll have to add that in the souvenir box. So that's pretty cool. Thank you, Jill R. I love that picture. Um, gosh, how am I going to keep that? You know, really, where this should go is at my desk, straight up, and you know, there's one, two, three, four in the. Yeah, the smaller ones on the left side on the bottom. And then that way when I say, where's all the Paddington stuff, Patty stuff, that's where they'll be, I hope. You guys got to help me remember that, okay? Because we want to include that letter and the picture of Patty in with um, in with uh, the souvenirs from Patty. And you, my Shasta baby, yes. This one is from Amazon. One of them. Yeah, this is the one. This one's been sitting there for almost a week or maybe over a week. And uh, I have to show you what the kitties did to it. They've been in it already. <laughs> the cats did, got into it. They, they even tore all the plastic out of it already. But I did not pee. They tried to tell me what was in it, but I didn't listen to them. Ooh, yay, raw. No wonder they got into it. We got three cases of friskies, which are, um, we were getting a little low on the friskies. So thank you. But let's see if we know who this is from. Maybe, maybe. Oh, no. Hang on a second. See all my papers over here? Some of these have notes from people who told me they were going to send stuff. Um, let me check. Yeah. 
I have, I'm supposed to have a box coming from a bill. Um, but he didn't tell me what was coming. So does anyone know who these are from? There's three, there's three, um, 32 packs of the Friskies. This one is the seafood. And there's another seafood. There is. I think this there is, is another seafood. Yep. This is another 32 pack of seafood. And then we have a 32. Are those, are those, um, oh, those are both pâtés. I know that one. Is. Oh, that one is too. Yeah. And this one is frisky. Um, these are fillets and bits and shreds, um, poultry variety pack. So maybe somebody can um, let Nuki know who sent that, okay? I appreciate it. That came probably, is that from you, Deb? Oh, Deb, I do have a note here from you. Um, January 18th. I got, Deb, I got your letter yesterday and this box has been here um, for from last week so I'm not sure but I know Deb has three cases of friskies coming I'm going to stick this back up yet Deb until I know for sure where's my do? my do? <laughs> you should see my door frame. I've got I've got papers and notes around the whole thing. But thank you, thank you for um, the food there. Maybe we can find out for sure. But I know Deb Deb sent me an email too. And that's, this is this is my fault for this being confusing since I didn't get these opened up in a in a timely manner. <laughs> The <laughs> castle almost became squishy fied. This one is also from Amazon. Yeah, we got some more more crispies. This looks a lot like the other one. Actually, it is. Now, this is kind of strange. Look at this. Oh, now this one's a 24 pack of the seafood. And this one is prime fillets. So it's almost identical to what we just opened. And <laughs> what are you doing? And this one is a 32 pack seafood. These guys are going to be, they do like the seafood, you know. And this one is a pate. So it is very similar to the one we just did and a 32 pack exactly like what we just opened also there's just one little variation and I don't have a slip at all on this one and they also sent us a cat <laughs> <laughs> they sent us a Plymouth lookalike say hi everybody say whoever sent that we sure do appreciate it say was it Deb? Huh? Was it Deb or who did it? Oh, that Farrah is being naughty. Farrah's chasing the cat in there. Oh, I'm sorry, Siri. So do we have a claimer on that one? Oh, I sure hope we find out who did them so we can say our, say our thank yous. I always feel bad when we don't get to it. No. Mm -hmm. We can just put it in there. By the door, and then I take them out. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh my! This is nice to get our frisky supply caught back up again. Very, very nice. This one is a different one. This is from Sharon G. From Acumetric, Acumetric, from Elizabethtown, Kentucky. Oh, and this is from Steve and Deb Brady. Um, give me half a second. I might have a paper from them. One of these days I'll get all those notes caught up. So maybe they just used the box from 
um, from Acumetries. Whoops. I can't hit a straight line. Yeah, so this is from Steve and Deb B. from Kentucky. And we have an envelope, which you guys know I love envelopes. Especially when there's notes inside them. And this says, Dear Jackie, staffs and Staffers, and Kitty, after becoming bird wet, oh, wait, I'm sorry, after becoming bird web watchers, we felt compelled to go shopping. After this box of potpourri, hope, hope, oh my gosh, I can't even talk tonight. Hope this box of potpourri will help out. We appreciate all of you and the work you do for our feline friends. Stephen Debbie B. from Elizabethtown, Kentucky. And here's their kitties. I love it when you guys send kitties. This is Gracie. This, oh, oh, she's got on here the company cat. And listen to this. I think she's Twinkle's twin, a good mouser. That does look really a lot like Twinkle. And then this is Peaches. He may think he's a dog. <laughs> Isn't he cute? I remember the first time that I held a picture up at the cam. I was really impressed with how well it showed. This is um, our Princess Callie, rescued from the pound. Oh, when when Princess was only two pounds. Well, it looks like Princess has grown a whole lot. Pretty, pretty cat. Oh, a typical kitty in a box. Boo. I mean, do a good home from our vet. What a guy. Oh, free to a good home from our vet. What a guy. Well, you got a great cat there. Look at that. Don't you love it when you see a cat sleeping in a box? So this is from Stephen Debbie B. Yeah, he's like just stick back in. Oh, tape stuck to me. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, Nuki, you got your work cut out for you here. Do you know where the treaties go? Okay, we've got a whole bunch of treats, which is nice. Because you guys all know how our cats love to treat. Actually, if you take these, I'll show you where these are going to go. Oh my um, God, did someone do something? Hang on a second. I'm going to show Judy where we're going to, where these treaties go. Hang on a second. Kitties like their treaties. And two extra litter scoopers. A purple, which my daughter Karen would love. She loves anything with purple. And sponges. Oh, this is quite a view of right potpourri of sponges. Assorted sponges multi pack. And there is indeed. We never have enough sponges. We're always using those. And paper plates. The big paper, paper plates, we'll put those over. Those go in pen three. And, oh, Nine Lives, wow, you're a good packer. You guys are good packers. Nine Lives, there's two of them. These are um, grilled tuna and egg flavors. Judy, these go behind the light blue door back there. Okay. This is nice. Judy's putting it away as we, as we do it. Oh, my goodness sakes. We have, sp I just said we never have enough sponges. Look at this. Cool. And you guys won't believe what this is all packed inside. Let me show you this. It's packed inside in a sleeping cube. Uh -oh. Look at this. Oh, posty notes. Oh, more posty notes. And Q tips. Oh, we oh these are nice too. Yes. Yes. 
Those are those um, little pad things that go onto it. We use those for cleaning ears. They're instead of cotton balls or the gauze pads. I'll use those for that. My goodness. And that's the Q-tip, Brittany Ann. We like that, too. And, oh, baby food. Gosh, you've got a little bit of everything in here. And, oh, you were smart. You wrapped the Dawn in plastic and it arrived safely. It did not break open. Do you want me to catch it some of those? And you know where it goes to work? Okay. 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 Morley, are you going to town? And more posty notes? I think our container over there is a little low, so I'll put one of those in there. And magic erasers. We use a ton of these. I'm sure everybody in the United States uses these now, or in the world. They're the best. They're the best for cleaning up things. And the small Lysol containers. These size are nice sometimes to get to because... Um, Dog got out. Oh, the latch went over by mistake. I've never seen that happen because these fit in our new bathroom upstairs or in out there. They fit up in the uh, cabinet up there where the big ones don't. I thought sure one of the doggies got out of the fence and was running. And we've got the 13 gallon and the 30 gallon trash container bags. Thank you, thank you. We use a lot of these. We produce a lot of trash, unfortunately, here. Hey, you guys. And check this out. This is what everything came in. Isn't that nice? I like it. I know it. Look at the little, it's got little fishies. You see, it's got little fishies on there. Yeah, isn't that great? And it cushioned everything. Nothing broke, nothing spilled. That's really Yeah, nice. thank you. Thank you. That's an awesome gift. Who wants to be in there first? Well, it was only 17 when I came. Oh, and then Sunday is supposed to be up in the 50s. Did you know that? No, I did not know Yeah. That. Oh, my God. Um, Cindy. I have a note from Cindy. Yay. Put the envelope inside. I, oh, I taped it underneath the white address. Cindy Lou, are you on? Yep. <laughs> she sent me an email saying that she for she just packed the box to send to the center and she forgot to put the envelope inside that contains a card and a check for her for their um, four squares. So I taped it underneath the white address card. Yep, there it is, Cindy. It arrived nice, safe, and sound. Okay for box time. That was pretty clever. Cutter must have been telling you guys how to do all this packing. Aww, that's a pretty stationery. says, Dear Jackie, please use these old blankets wherever they are needed most. Kitty City, barn cats, house cats, whoever needs a warm snuggly to sleep on. I'm hoping someone is talented enough to use the fabric pictures. Ooh, we'll have to take a look. They could be pillows or even just frames. If a volunteer would like to have them, that's okay with us too. Also enclosed is our check for square 67 of the floor. Toby and Missy send their love too, Dave and Cindy. And Dave is D.L. Menzer and Cindy is Cindy Luhu. Thank you, Cindy and Dave. I appreciate the that. Floor? They sold our floor. The web cameras all went together really? and divided up all the floor squares or oh. all the floor into square feet. Mm -hmm. Three hundred and what was it? Three hundred and sixty-three of them for fourteen dollars a piece. Wow! And they raised five thousand dollars so we could finish paying for the floor. Wow! In two weeks they did that. I didn't know they were doing that. Yeah, oh, gosh, I didn't. I didn't you're either. Doing stuff. I know it. Yeah. yeah, thank you. I'm going to hold off on that other thing we talked about. That's the kitty 
Oh. Cindy, thank you. You guys all know that these these blankies are awesome. They're those um, flannel ones, and they're re they really are toasty warm. We use these for everybody. And I also had one person had cut some of these up and um, um, hemmed them and made them even to, into smaller ones. But what's nice about them is they're not only cozy warm, they uh, wash and dry just in minutes. Well, washing, of course, oh. is the same, but drying is just in minutes. She's limping. Who, oh, is that what I yes. She might need to come in my house tonight for a TLC. Oh, and there's yeah. a baby one. There's a baby one, too. Oh, and a teddy bear? We have we now have a cabinet on the other side that holds our um, some of our blinkies like this, and here's one that's got the teddy bears on it. And here's this. You know what? We'll just we'll just lay this right out there for you, cutie. And here's the frames. Gosh, Pat, is there something you can do with these? Check these out. Oh my gosh. Let me show them and then I can give them to you. Isn't that cool? Pat's our craft person. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, lots and lots of fuzzy blankies. Oh, so there's two of these, Pat. Oh, and Boy, boy we one. needed someone who does quilting. Ah, <gasps> uh, my sister does uh -huh. quilting. She could do something great. Yeah. Great. Aren't these beautiful? We'll do that. Okay. And then maybe, maybe, maybe it can be auctioned off. Oh, that would be cool, That too. would make an awesome little quilt. That would be. Okay, here. We got that yeah. one. And then that one there. Isn't oh, that let's pretty? See. You got that would be a great like idea. That. And let's see. This one? Oh, that look one. at this one. That's very pretty. And, okay, so is there yes. another one of this one? Sunny's thinking ahead. Like that. I'm not sure. Cindy sent these. I don't know if somebody and, okay, that's good. made and them. Okay, that's good. And then uh, put this one like at that one. So there's two of these. Oh, we need another one. Oh, Judy. Yeah, Judy. Yeah. She'll figure it out. If, yeah, if, there, if it's an odd number, why can't it be made into a little pillow? Yeah. Oh, oh that, that would um, be awesome. I don't know if that's painted on. Or how that is, but it certainly is beautiful. Mm -hmm. I mean, even check out how detailed the eyes are. Isn't that cool? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I think we'll put these together. That's a good idea, yeah, Pat. That would make a great yeah. little fundraiser. Just wait till my sister gets these. <laughs> I'm always having her do things. Well, if I ever get a chance to take a sewing class at Joanne's, then maybe one day I can start doing that. Uh, I really need a, a good start with it. Like, just getting used to the machine would probably help a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Geez, I, I now have three sewing machines, and I really don't know what I'm doing with any of them. Zelda's over there in one of the boxes back there. Look at her. Isn't she just the cutest thing? Just love her. Um, I got one more box here. This is from David H. And David H. is from Warren, Ohio. And we have a card here from, from Dave. Oh, it's okay, honey. It says, to Jackie, to share with the cats. Hope you are doing as well as you can. Take care. Dave H. Oh, Dave is who adopted Burka. Dave is who, that was Pat's good buddy I friend. I missed my birthday. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look at what's in here. Dave, you are a oh, rascal. I'm Thank you. We yeah. got sardines. We got one can. Yeah, another one really Two. Everything. Yep, and these are in spring water. No salt added. Good deal. Three. Oh, and extra virgin olive oil. Those are good, too. Four. And thank you, Dave. 
A box of sardines. Okay, so the kitties can have one or two cans in the morning, and I, whenever I do sardines, they get the whole can other than I take a fork and I pick out one sardine and I get it. Per, one sardine per can. So um, they have to share. I share with them, they have to share with me. So uh, just to give you a couple updates, and thank you, Dave. Thank you, everybody. And hopefully somewhere along the line we figured out who sent all that wonderful um, friskies because that helped restock our supply really well. And I appreciate that so very much, very, very much. Um, you guys you guys are tops. And I want to trade any of you for anything. You guys are just all wonderful. I wanted to let you know today, too, that I got a, the Pet Finder. A weekly report and stats and um, this past week we had 2,701 2,701 hits on our pet finders and this I thought was really interesting um, of course the four top ones is a given I knew that those would be Siri is top with 340 and then Raina is next with 283. Badu is still up there, 219, and Tasco is still on there. They can go back into our adoption one, so people are still looking at Tasco for 125. But this is what's really interesting is Derby is number five at 101. That's interesting how, how the numbers change. I'll just name you, like, maybe the first 10, top 10 or 12, so you have an idea. Uh, Cosimo, Emmeline, Emmeline's way up there. Hetty, Wiggles, which Wiggles has been gone. Possum, County, Merci, Cinnabon, Bushka, Ernestine, Octavia, and then our information. And then the second page is lists lots and lots and lots of them. But those were the top 10 or so, 10, 12. Uh, but Siri, Raina, Radu, Tasco, and Derby are the top five. So that's pretty cool. And um, just really want to ask you all if you can please, please, please vote. We, we have been flipping back and forth with the Blind Cat one uh, for first and second place all week long. It's been quite a contest, hasn't it? Just It's been back and forth and back and forth. But... Today we slipped back a little bit. We're in second place, and the margin that they have grew a little bit. So, oh, Zelda is limping. We'll have to check Zelda out here. Um, so we'll have to, uh, if you guys can help me with passing on uh, to your family and friends, neighbors, email friends, to please, please help us vote. If we have one really, really good day of voting, I bet you we can um, pop up there again and if we can stay into second place then that guarantees us the uh, highest win for second week which is second which is a thousand dollar win so that would be really cool too um, Anakin and Jason Anakin and Jason are right over here they're in in uh, patience's pen Jason is doing real well he's eating by himself Anakin has really had a hard day she, I'm syringe feeding her every couple hours. Um, she, her bottom that was so bad last night is much, much better. And she's willingly taking food, but she's not up to taking it by herself. So we're just keeping a real close eye on her and um, making sure that she's hydrated. Everybody else is doing real well, uh, real, real well. Donna and Weasley. Oh, I gotta, I gotta make their appointments for their flight physical. I'm sure they'll pass this time. Um, I gotta call tomorrow and get, get them in, and hopefully they'll be able to go in on Saturday or Monday. Um, I'll have to coax somebody into helping me get them up there because I just don't have any extra time. Uh, so we'll get them in for their physicals. And we had two adoptions today. This wonderful gentleman came today. And uh, he adopted Possum and Polio together. And I'm telling you, I just think those two cats are absolutely astounding. And uh, they both just were crazy about him. 
and he with them. They, it was just an instant light on both sides. So mm -hmm. I was really tickled with that. So um, Possum and Polio was went today. Um, I have somebody that is going to come Saturday morning, I think, is interested in Arena. So we'll see how that goes. So that was that'll be Rena maybe for Saturday morning, and then the other big news is uh, the 28th. 28th, which is a week from tomorrow, we are going to have another surgery day. I just finally got to talk to Cindy and Bonnie, and uh, I'll I'll call Lynette and Sue yet too to see if they can help help me with this. Um, but Cindy is willing to come in on uh, the 28th. Oh, that's the day. Oh, that's the day that, oh, Weasley goes and Donna goes and um, we have all of our visitors. So that's okay. I got to, we got to do it when Cindy can do it. So we've got five girls who is uh, Fifi, Ayla, Anakin. Gina and Promise, and then one boy, Jason. So we got to get our our uh, Anakin better by then. So we've got five girls and one boy that uh, hopefully we'll be able to get them spayed or neutered. So that's the 27th. Is it the 20th? Is it? Oh yeah, it's Friday. I think it is Friday that Lini is coming. So we're we're fine on that. Yeah, we like visitors. Yeah. Weasley and Donna go on the 27th. Okay, you guys are right on the ball on that. Thank you for that. And Feline, yeah, I know. You, you're you one of these days, you're, you really are going to come and take Bella. <laughs> so I think that's all that I have today. Oh, the floor is scheduled. You're asking about the floor. The floor is scheduled for the 30th. And I will find me on um, the party. Right Wednesday, here. this coming Wednesday, the company or the uh, bar, no, I'm sorry, Bruce and, there's Patty, that's going to be doing the floor. They're going to be, bring the big trailer on, on Wednesday. And then I already talked to Jimmy and Paul, mm -hmm. and they're going to help us, of course. They're going to be our furniture carrier outers. But on Friday and Saturday next week they're going to start taking out the little bits of furniture and on Saturday night Sunday they'll take out everything <laughs> so it's going to be bare naked in here some of you people were really worried this morning about having withdrawals from the kitties but no need to worry because the cam is going to go around the corner and we're going to put the majority of the kitties and cats are going to be in the office, and I'll just rig up something and put the cam into the office so you will have access for um, for all the kitties. So, yeah, we only got, what would you say, Judy, a quarter of an inch of snow, if that? I think we got an inch. An inch of snow, really? Yeah. We're supposed to where get... Where I live. Where you live, which she's not very far from me. And, uh... Oh, 10, 13 miles. 10, 13 miles, is it really? Mm -hmm. Are we still supposed to get a couple inches tonight? Somebody said 4 to 6, but I don't believe mm. it. I don't believe it. I don't believe that either. We didn't get but what I heard was... They said last time. Yeah. What I heard was 1 to 3, maybe. Okay. <laughs> Fira was staring straight at the wall. Have you been naughty? Yes, you were just naughty. You were chasing a kitty. Fair's put herself in a corner. She's looking at the wall. She knows she was naughty. So I think that's all that we've got, and I'm going to put things, finish putting things away, although I think Judy's got it all under control, and I'll come out in a little bit and set up the playground for the evening. And um, thank you all for joining us. I appreciate it. One of these nights real soon, we'll get back to getting the questions and answers, and also I've got to get the blog started back up. I, I really neglected that also. So give me... Within a week, and I'll be back to snuff and everything and get everything caught up. So thank you, everybody. Take care. Stay warm out there, okay? Hmm. Still trying to figure out what's going on with the Walmart Foundation. I checked to see, you know, what the progress is. On yours? Uh-huh. And it says it's pending organization Ooh. authorization. 
Well, I, I, I did it. I thought well, I did it. That's, so I sent them an email asking them, what does that mean? Okay. So I haven't okay. heard it back yet. I've never emailed them before, so where are I did then. Did you do the thing what I did before? Yeah. I can't think of anything different. Okay. So maybe they're just behind or something. I don't know why she didn't buy that much. I probably will. <laughs> Like, you want to take a look at it, how it looks on your furniture. Yeah.